Hello everyone, welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. And in today's video, we are going to be discussing a really hot topic right now. My top 5 BSC, Binance Smart Chain DeFi Coins. I believe that we are going to see a massive explosion in DeFi purely on the side of Binance Chain and uh, just because they're <laughs> just performing so well and we know we're going to dive through this in this video. If this sounds interesting to you, please drop a like, give me a uh, give my words out, subscribe and I'm going to dive into this with you but before I do so, I need to let you know I'm not a financial advisor. These are just my own personal opinions on the market. So please always do your own research before investing any money. That being said, guys, we have been seeing Binance explode. And a lot of you are probably thinking, how? Why? Why is it <laughs> in the top three? Because, you know, for the first time in a long time, Ethereum has been the one coin to always provide, um, provide a lot of DeFi, right? DeFi tokens. And this is because they were the only ones that were sort of really supporting hard on like the DeFi protocol, right? So you, you, you could see it on DeFi Pulse. I haven't got it up here. But now there's a new sheriff in town. <laughs> Just a bit like Toy Story. You know, like when you see Woody and Buzz Lightyear? <laughs> well, Ethereum was Woody <laughs> and Binance uh, coin is Buzz Lightyear. And as you can see here on these uh, websites here that I've shown you, this is called Dapp Radar. Binance is offering smart well they use they're using the smart chain to offer DeFi tokens for people to yield farm and stake and guys it is absolutely massive i can't express any more to you guys how big that DeFi aspect the def uh, get my words out the DeFi space is growing okay it finally came out i'm gonna take you through my top five but i really do think that you guys should be looking at dap radar and you know, DeFi uh, Station. These are two good sites that you can go on to see what DeFi coins are available on the Binance Smart Chain BSC. You see it here, right? These coins are set to explode, and I really do believe there's some serious gains to be made with these coins. And you know, I think you should be like me. I'm one of these people that want to get in early. I want to get in early on these coins before they start pumping up in these, this chart here. You know, you've already seen some of them pump up. And, uh, but yeah, let me get into this. I'm talking too much. My first coin that I believe should be in my top five is Pancake Swap. <laughs> Every time I make a video on this, the price just keeps rising. I think the very first time I did a video on this, it was five pounds. <laughs> and then I talked about buying it. And then it was like seven, eight pounds. And that's 13 pounds. And I don't think this is going to stop. And I'm not even joking, guys. I can't be more serious in myself when I say this, that... I think, me, myself, I, I personally think that now that Binance, oh, they're so smart, <laughs> the smart chain, right? Now that Binance is offering DeFi on their, platf on, their, on their platform, right? Or offering DeFi tokens to yield farm, I think that Binance coin, and I know this sounds crazy, it, at some point in the future, Binance coin is going to, dethrone ethereum i really do see it purely for the fact that it's bringing so much liquidity into the DeFi space on their binance chain right the binance smart chain and pancake being one of them offering liquidity on top of loads of others i mean look, you can click into the farming here and you can see what people are farming You'll have to look into this uh, in, in order to learn staking LP tokens. LP stands for liquidity pools. It basically takes two coins and then you can, you know, uh, lend out money and, and obviously borrow money. It's, it's, it's an interesting one. You have to look into it. But, you know, you do earn uh, a nice percentage here, APR. But obviously anything is a risk and, you know, you have to do your research before doing that. But what I'm saying is the liquidity is here, guys and pancake swap is showing a fine example of this and this coin you know even if you don't want to stake it and you don't want to yield farm it just by holding it you know because if you had held it back from here what was 27 pence what the hell was i doing back then <laughs> 17 pence don't i swear to, is it going lower i was gonna say 17 pence that took me just there <sighs> guys <laughs> What was we doing back then? 
because people weren't paying attention. Well, there was obviously some people paying attention, but most of the average people that are in the market today are not paying attention. They look at coins like Pancake Swap, <laughs> just the name, <laughs> and you start laughing. You're thinking, oh, they probably made that on Pancake Day. <laughs> There's a reason why these coins are exploding. And again, you know, DeFi station, it shows it, look, sitting up in the third place. I said this on uh, the video that I released before on PancakeSwap. I believe that these coins are going to be around for a long, long time. And I may even be considering uh, holding these coins through a bear market as well. And I'm going to explain that in another video, but I just think that, you know, we could still be making some good gains whilst we do it. So pancake swap is my first. Let's move on to the second. Baker token, bakery token, <laughs> just to be precise, you know, bakery token is another DeFi BSC coin. And, you know, there's probably a lot of people that are into DeFi already and understand this. But, you know, I know there's new people watching every day. And I know that there's going to be new people on my channel watching, learning, just like me, learning about DeFi tokens. Guys, Bakery Swap is another one that allows people to yield, farm, and I believe stake your crypto. I was just trying to check here as well. Like, it's got so much liquidity coming into this coin. It's mad absolutely insane well this is an exchange right? these exchanges guys are just like uniswap in my eyes they're just like uniswap in the way they work you can you know go on there swap your coins and again decentralized and then you can obviously start yield farming them but the fact that you know you're seeing this on the binance smart chain is insane there's more to bakery swap that i've been looking into you know they're offering nfts now for those who are new into the crypto industry and doesn't understand what nft means it's a non fungible token and you might be saying to yourself well what is an, what's an <laughs> a non-fungible token imagine this when you was a kid right you had pokemon cards <laughs> listen i had great pokemon cards i remember having this mew card it was like an ancient mew and it was like holo and it's like all over the place and like, my friend gave it to me and i was like what are you giving me this he's like yeah yeah just take it man <laughs> a few days later i found out it was fake <laughs> but i was happy because i had an ancient mew what i'm getting at is this that if you have just one card that separates the from the rest of the cards you'll never ever be able to get that card again that's classed as a non-fungible token so what you're seeing happening in the, in the crypto space right now is people are creating like paintings uh like i said trading cards these sort of things and there's only one of them you can never ever get more and and imagine just the one Pokemon card being unique to you. Meaning, there's loads of Charizard cards, right? But imagine if there was just one Charizard card that looked totally different. And you could never get it anywhere else. And you was the only one that had it. That's what's what they class as a non-fungible token. And when you sell it on, you're selling on the non-fungible token asset to someone else. And they're receiving the, 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 that, that clarity, that clarification, the verification, the certification. As my mum would say, the certification. <laughs> all the t's the authenticity <laughs> uh you basically receive everything that you need on that one token and no one else can ever have it and that's why nfts are blowing up and i can see trading cards in the future and i see them in the shops people buying these football stickers these football trading cards whatever they are i can imagine things like that happening in the crypto space and then you know trading cards coming out allowing kids to have digital assets in their hand insane and Bakery's taken a part of this. So that's that's interesting. Let's move on to the next coin. Number three, any swap. Took me a time to really try and figure out as to why I want to add this, but it really does make sense. And <laughs> I would have been stupid to have not have done it. Now, obviously, you're looking in the charts here. You can see that it's, it's all of these. All of these um, Binance Smart Chain tokens have been exploding in price over the last few weeks. And, you know... It's, and this is obviously why you're also seeing Binance coin explode as well, because these are really bringing in liquidity to the DeFi space on the Bly, uh, on the Bly, on the Binance. Oh God, get my words out on the BSC. I just say that because easy. <laughs> Binance Smart Chain. Now, when I look at any swap, let me explain to you how I think this is different, and it's really clever what they're doing, because any swap is enabling you to swap right down here. Look, swap between any coin on any blockchain that is absolutely insane doesn't matter which uh, blockchain you're on bitcoin ethereum binance xrp litecoin it says it here you can swap any coin on any chain which is mad 
And this is what I'm talking about when I come, when I talk about interoperability with coins. And this is setting a fine example about you know being able to have that interoperability. This is a little look at their little um I say little <laughs> big because <laughs> look at the bloody liquidity that they're bringing in. It's just rising so much over the weeks as it goes. Actually, this is even in weeks. This is week. <laughs> oh no, it is weeks because the fourth of Feb. You look from the fourth of Feb, from the about like, TVL. Total value locked. So this is what people were putting their money in and it was just holding. They're just holding it into the project, right? Or into the, the liquidity, into pools or farming, whatever you want to call them. Uh, look back here. 241,000. Look at how high it went. And then it shot up to 800,000, almost a million. It's come down a little bit. But again, guys, I'm trying to prepare you for what's about to come, the future. And maybe you should, and this is not investment advice. But maybe you should consider looking into Binance Smart Chain assets. And you can use, and what is this? This is the third coin, right? I'm just going to show you real quick. Look, DeFi Station, remember this. Pull it in. Because I think that in order to, you know, reap rewards, you have to learn to. Have you seen, have you read that book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad? Because I've read it, and it's really interesting what they say, you know, because if the, if the poor dad was to copy everything that the rich dad did, the poor dad would be rich as well. You just have to follow what the money's doing and where the market's going. And this is what's happening. DeFi, uh, right, I was going to say DeFi Pulse. <laughs> DeFi right now is a thing, especially on the Binance chain. Do you know why? Do you know why? Especially because Ethereum's fees are so damn high. And I'm sure you've been buying coins like Pundi X and all these other coins. And you've been trying to send them across to your ledgers. <laughs> but the fee is so high and you're probably thinking, man, that's so high just to send it to my ledger. But Binance Smart Chain, such low fees. And this is what's really working for people. And what, what's going to happen, right? And this is my little prediction. And it's, it's already happening. You're going to see money come out of Ethereum. A lot of money. A lot. And fly into Binance Coin. Because they're going to be using the Smart Chain. Because the fees are lower. And, you know, you can get access to all these brand new toys. <laughs> That's how I look at it, like Buzz and Woody, yeah? Because you had your Woody. You've had Woody for a long time. <laughs> but now you've got a brand new toy on top of the bed <laughs> with all kind of gadgets. <laughs> and these are the gadgets. That's how I see it, you know, looking at uh, Woody over here. And then you've got Buzz Lightyear just sitting there looking nice in third place. And he's got all these new gadgets that we're looking at one by one. Let's, mo <laughs> Let's move on to the fourth coin. But anyway, so the, yeah, this is uh, any swap. I haven't even done... Actually, I might go back on them in a second, but I just want to, I want to expose you to these coins, right? So let's look at the next coin, then we'll do that, right? So the next coin that I think people should be watching is Pancake Bunny. <laughs> I know, guys, the, the, the word, the, the titles are just insane when you think about it. But you have to start taking these coins serious. Now, I don't recommend people to you know invest in any any of their money into these things without doing their own research and the reason i say you must do your research is because these coins so well yeah coins and projects are fairly new this site i don't know how long it's been out for but look at the total locked liquidity <laughs> or volume there's so much money going into these uh, projects or apps, D apps, DApps, whatever you want to call them, and people are making insane gains. You know, look at this: six hundred eighty-seven percent. Just by by farming state, uh, farming your cake, staking your cake. You want to stake your cake? <laughs> you can stake bunny. There's all sorts of things you can do here. Again, look into it before you really invest in flipping your uh, uh, tokens. But yeah, I think that this is another one to watch. I mean, look at the price, guys, for one coin. And you know what? When when I used to look at coin market cap, right? And let me just quickly go on this. I used to look at these, right? And I used to go, oh, uh, top ten, top twenty, they look safe. I wouldn't go down like to hundred and fifty, uh, two hundred and fifty or something like that, because I think, uh, actually, I don't know if that's a good coin. It might, <laughs> might not be stable. And then I look at Pancake, right? Look at the rank, 2380 2, something, and I'm thinking, oh my god. I used to think like that, but now my game's changed. My mindset has changed. To me, it doesn't matter the rank, because things change fast. And if this gets the right exposure, like I believe it's getting, I mean, let's have a look. <laughs> number five in the DeFi station look at how much liquidity is locked up in this DeFi space guys 
the money is you're talking over 10 billion that's a lot of money locked up and pancake bunny is taking 350 sorry 381 million dollars locked up now mad absolutely insane again not investment advice but i just need to bring it to your attention what's going on right now and i think these are coins that we should be really paying attention to my last coin now this one is not really listed on coin market cap or uh coin gecko yet but i believe it will be and when it does i believe it's going to be set to explode it's one of the new uh, DeFi coins on the binance smart chain i am talking about ape swap you can collect bananas <laughs> It's so funny to think about because the names and stuff, but you know what? I like this and I'll tell you why I like it because it's making it fun. And the thing is, when you invest money, you, you really do take yourself serious. And sometimes it is nice to just have a little lightheaded moment and just enjoy why you invest. And, you know, we're all here to make money at the end of the day, right? We are all here to make money at the end of the day. And let's just have a look. There's 11 million locked up, right? At the moment, like I said, this is a new coin. And again, I do not recommend anyone invest in, in until you do your own research, right? But, you know, this is generating 261,000 uh, uh, transactions, nine to 10,000 users. Like I said, it's a new coin, but the volume, guys, 122 million. It's mad. Absolutely mad. I'm going to dive into the thing in a second. Uh, I just wanted to show you this. I think there's like 4 million coins in total for this. 4 million let's see what happens if i click go advanced does it show more data on it nope there's roughly around 4 million and i'm going to show you it here anyway if we come onto that site you can see looks very similar to pancake swap right very similar that's because they've done a hard fork and i like this because you know it's when i look at like coins there's so many coins that have been hard forked and but well bitcoin's an example like how many times it's been hard forked bitcoin cash and there are coins that are hard forking and i think there's always room for them especially with the the massive craze that's going right now in the DeFi pulse uh DeFi pulse space well yeah well in the in, on the binance smart chain there's so much hype happening right now and look at it guys look look at this this is dap radar look what it's showing right here <laughs> fourth place <laughs> ape swap you see i was trying to highlight it don't let me just making me move it but ape swap is sitting in fourth place on that radar new new and like i said guys if you want to if you want to think about making money you have to get into these coins early imagine if you'd got into pancake again not investment advice imagine if you'd got into pancake when it was down here <laughs> 19 pence 25 pence Imagine if you got in at them prices. And let me just show you that what it looks like in dollars. I should have had this up. I don't even know why I haven't got it up. Let's just shrink this to make it look neat. Nine, 19 pence, guys. Imagine if you'd got in. Oh, <laughs> it's going to be 26 cents. Uh, let me delete that. Why ain't it deleting? Come on. You're messing me up already. Hold on. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> Point 0.19. You're looking at 27 cents. Imagine getting in on pancake swap at 27 cents, right? If you just got in early and look at the price now 12 pound 63 uh well 13 pound 69 that's not even showing it as highest look look at the price now 13 pound 69 you would have bought in at 27 cents and look 19 pounds 19 dollars 12 cents that is absolutely insane so i look at coins like ape swap and I start to take it serious because I believe it's going to be bringing in liquidity. And guys, I can already see that it is. Look here, eleven million dollars in balance, twenty-seven million in volume. You know, there's money coming into this, and you know it, <laughs> that it's very self-explanatory. Look over here, total banana supply, five million. So okay, so bananas are being um, minted every single time that people stake and farm this coin right not sure how high it's going to go but i do know that they're burning coins as they go on as well they're definitely burning coins and you can see this in the documents i've done my research and this is what i want you guys to do before you invest any money do your research they've got a roadmap here they talk about the burning so when they finally do get on like the coin market cap because you can see here their goals to be listed on coin market cap coin gecko this is a good time to get in early 
me personally, I believe. And uh, yeah, you know, we can see some great gains, I think, with this. And just think about it like this, right? Because I've done all five coins now. Just think about it like this. Right now, today, the total supply is five, five million, actually, near enough. Five million, eighty thousand. Guys, look at Bitcoin. Bitcoin has a total supply of 21 million. And look at the price of Bitcoin. 37,000. <laughs> this coin has 5 million at the moment. Even if this went to 21 million coins, right? Who knows? We could see it potentially be sitting on a price like this in the future. Who knows? It really opens up my mind because if it does... And you're getting in now, early, whilst it's sitting on two dollars and forty cents for one coin, right down here, bottom left. Look at this, <laughs> two dollars and forty cents. I'm gonna show you what that looks like in British pounds. Let me just show you. We'll do this, because right now, if you was to grab some some bananas, <laughs> if it lets me type in, if you was to grab some bananas, two dollars and what forty two cents is one pound seventy three for one banana. And you can stake it. And you know what's the maddest thing is? Look at the returns, the APR, right? Look at the pools. I thought I'd try this out. I'm staking some of it right now. And I've already made five <laughs> since when I went to sleep last night to now. <laughs> what is five times two? For? I believe I'm going to be making around 17 in a day, right? Or, or, or something like that. 17 coins in a day, something like that. And uh, because look at the returns, guys. 2,000% annually my god i need to do a, i think i need to give this its own video i'm not going to go more into this i'm going to give it its own video that does this this coin deserves its own video like many other coins do but that was my top five coins i think you should really pay attention to the binance smart chain and the DeFi space in that area and really consider looking at some of these coins so yeah let's just quickly do what i was going to do because that was a uh, pancake so that was ape swap we done pancake bunny looked at it here let's have a little look down here you're looking at at the moment it's got max supply of a million again guys bitcoin's 21 million and it's sitting on thirty-seven thousand. it only makes me wonder how much higher this is going to go in price if you start earning tokens we could probably see this go up to ten thousand. Who knows? Uh, that's me, myself, I, I believe, right? You know, let's take a look at any swap again because, you know, right now it's at £1.33. It has seen explosions since the last few weeks because of the DeFi that's going on in the Binance Smart Chain. But, guys, 100 million. 100 million in supply. And you know how I am on my channel. I love to look at supply in coins and compare them against others. And when I look at a coin with 100 million and then look at Binance coin with 100 million... Because they've got, well, they've got more, right? They've got 170 million, isn't it? Something like that. Let's have a look. Uh, where's the uh, f total supply for this? Uh, come down here. Total supply, 170 million, 500,000. And look at the price of this. 202 pounds. And right now, any swap <laughs> is sitting on one pound thirty three. Mad. So much room for these coins to grow. Look at the market cap. <laughs> I'm just going to show you, look, a little, a fine example, if any swap was to do a 10x from where it is now, yeah, just to show you, look at the market cap, let's times it by 10, because it's 20 million right now, 20 million 400,000, times it by 10, you're looking at a 200 million market cap, <laughs> what happens when you times stuff by 10 guys, you've seen it on my video channel, we move this across by one because you can move the decimal, you're looking at roughly 13 pounds. When any swap hits 200 million, you're looking at 13 pounds. What, you want to times it again? <laughs> we can do that because there's so much room to grow. 2 billion. Pancake swap is near enough coming on to 2 billion market cap. Look at this, 1.5. Guys, this is what I'm talking about by getting in early. This is what I'm talking about by getting in early. Right now, these coins, you could be getting in early, not investment advice. But... Again, I've told, I've kind of told you a little bit about what it does. You know, any swap how it has, it can cross train. You know, it can swap any coin on any blockchain, which is mad. If it was to do, go to two billion, essentially you're looking at a hundred and what is that? Hundred and thirty-three pound uh, token price because times ten is thirteen. 
times a 10 again, which was basically times 100, is 133 pounds. We could some point down the line see this hit 133 pounds from the price that it is now. That's insane. Maybe I should be putting some money into that. <laughs> but guys, let's move on to the next one real quick. Bakery token. I just want to open your mind to this stuff, guys, because there's so much happening in the DeFi space. I could sit here for hours talking about, uh, about this and sit here doing this all day long because I can see the true potential of what's about, uh, what's about to come. 500 million, right? When I look at bakery, uh, bakery swap, I compare it to Uniswap. So it's not bakery swap, bakery token. <laughs> they should have just called it bakery swap. Everything else is swap. <laughs> but bakery token, I compare it to the Uniswap uh, token as well. I'm trying to work out if it got uh, forked from uh, Uniswap. I don't know if it did or not. I'm going to have to do my research on that. But look, Uniswap has a total supply of 1 billion. And I like to go with the supply in my videos. You can go with the circulating if you want, but I get a better reading on total supply. Total supply with uh, a billion usually tends to reach this price here at right? £17. It actually went higher. It went as high as, uh, what's this? It says £16.50 there. Let me just come down here and have a look real quick. £16.84. Let me show you what that is in dollars. Because £16.84 is going to give me a rough estimate as to how high the other coin can go. Right? £16.84. $23. $23.50. Right? So when I look at Bakery now, sitting on £1.88, it could hit $23. You know? Again, what? Do you want to do the market cap thing here? Look at this. $244 million in in market cap right 20, 200, sorry 224 million 244 224 million market cap let's just times it by 10 let's just see how much room there is to grow in this DeFi space on the binance chain smart chain it would make a 2 billion market cap doing that you could times this or shift this over by one you'd be looking at a 19 pound price guys look let me do it again look 19 pounds when it hits a two billion, roughly a two point two billion market cap, I, I believe that's how it works. Anyway, but you know, I've done it before on Pancake. You know how I feel about Pancake on my last video. I'm going to show you again. Anyway, uh, well, this is already, you know, the market caps there, and there's still room for this to grow. I really do believe there's room for this to grow. Like I believe Pancake's going to be uh, really setting a fine example for Binance Smart Ch uh, Smart Chain. Get my words out. <laughs> Binance Smart Chain DeFi coins. It's a big, long, uh, twisted word, isn't it? But look at this, guys. 170 million cake. Sorry, what am I saying? 170. <laughs> I was blind. It's because I'm thinking about Binance, right? Because I was just about to compare it to Binance. 189 million coins, yeah? And Binance, where's my Binance? Has 170 million in supply. Very, very similar. And I said this in my last video. Very similar. Look, 170 million. I believe that it could hit a similar price in the future. Who knows? This is just pumping. I'm sure this said like 190 or something when I started this video. <laughs> I think I'm rambling on too much. But this is one of those videos, and I apologize if it's long, but it's one of those videos that you just can't rush. I need to really open your eyes to this space because Binance is doing such a big thing right now. And again, look, DeFi Station, you know, DAP Radar, these are the coins that I'm looking at right now over the next few months and i'm taking the opportunity to invest into them i'm gonna leave it here though i think i have spoken too much if this was helpful to you please drop a like give me a subscribe if you're new watching drop your comments down below let me know what you think on the uh, bsc tokens binance smart chain tokens are you holding any are you farming any are you staking any because if you're like me and you, <laughs> you're looking to take some mad rewards back, look, 2,000%, this needs its own video. <laughs> I'm going to leave it here. I want to give a shout out to all my patrons that have became, uh, became, become a patron of mine. Thank you guys so much. Shout out to Jack, Daniel Atkins, Toyin Ottery, Glenda, It's Time, Ross Burford, Zpax, Zpax, Silent Crypto, Abdul Kareen, uh, sorry, Abdul Kareem. <laughs> sorry, buddy. And Cora Black. Thank you so, so much for your support. I really appreciate that. And thank you for all the new patrons as well that have become a patron. I see you as well. Thank you so much for your support. Guys, I'm going to leave it here with you. Thank you for watching. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Cheers.